Hey guys, welcome back to another Mythic Legions review. This time we have the Templar Legion Builder from Four Horsemen Studios. On the back of the package we have some lore on the Mythic Legion universe. And on the side we have two pictures of the Legion Builder. So let's check them out. Four Horsemen packs their figures in the collector friendly packaging. Easy to remove or put back together. I really appreciate packaging like this. This is a Templar Legion Builder from Mythic Legions. No special backstory or anything like that, these figures are meant for army building. They come at a reduced cost because the paint schemes aren't as detailed as a premium figure. Although I'd argue that these figures are still very unique and a great value with all the accessories they come with. So let's check out some of that detail. The Templar has a golden cross design on his helmet with the spike at the top. On the side we can see some of that simple silver paint and a lot of rivets detailed around the helmet. On the chest we have a red cross design on the white tabard, it has a very clean look to it. The shoulder has plain silver paint on the plated shoulder armor. On the back we have those giant peg holes that every mythic legion figure has. Thankfully this legion builder comes with shoulder armor that we will be covering this up with later. The arms have that plated armor design all the way down to the hands. The lower part of the tabard goes past the belt and finishes that red cross design, it's sculpted in a wavy design. On the side of the figure we have that large heavy plated skirt. The legs have more of that great sculpting and keeps the figure interesting to look at despite the simple paint job. And finally the feet of the figure, from head to toe just that silver color but still looks great in my opinion. Let's check out the articulation. We have a ball jointed head, a shoulder that opens and rotates, bending and rotating elbow, a rotating forearm, Minor rotation at the wrist, it's blocked by the armor, and bends up and down. A ball jointed waist, very flexible thighs, knees that bend and rotation blocked by the armor, and lastly rotating and bending feet. Let's check out the accessories. The Templar comes with a pair of armored shoulders. It has pegs on the back to sock it into the armor. To install the shoulder armor, all you need to do is match the pegs on the back and press them into the socket. We have a large shield with a matching red cross design on it. The back has a peg to attach the shield grip onto it. To install the shield, you just clip it into the arm. It fits on the wrist tightly and holds into place easily. And we also get a banner with the red cross design. The top has a socket for more attachments but we don't get any extra. It has two other pole accessories to increase the length of the banner. When completed it is a very large piece. We have a standard one handed sword with the golden handle. And we have a very long pike weapon. The top is removable for different spearheads but we don't get any extra. We have a brown and rubbery belt with the slot to equip a weapon. And lastly we have a smaller alternate collar. To install the alternate collar you need to remove the head and the neck joint. After you can pull the collar out and replace it with the smaller one. The smaller collar shows off more of the red cross so I prefer it to the original. Overall, I'm very impressed with the Templar Legion Builder. He comes with a ton of accessories and also includes a banner and an extra collar. That's more than most premium figures get. He's a really great value, especially if you're starting out in this toy line. Four Horsemen are known for having great sculpting, and as an army builder figure with a simple paint job, the sculpting really carries this figure with only four different colors. These figures are getting really hard to find lately, but if you can wait for a reissue, they will be your best bet on getting these figures for a reasonable price. Legion builders go for 22 bucks, and for that price, this is an absolute steal with the amount of accessories you get. Mythic Legion figures are compatible with each other, so you can swap out any piece you want with another piece. And with the simple head swap, you get a great effect like an undead Templar Knight. I definitely recommend picking up a few Legion builders if you want to test out this toy line. Alright guys, that'll do it for me. More reviews coming up soon, so stay tuned.